All their makeup is horrible. The, the woman will get eyelash rich here from here to there. They are not natural. But I want to speak about your criticism of Nollywood. You know, you what would be your biggest criticism of Nollywood as we have? They have ignored professional standards. Okay. It's as if you want to be a tailor, mm -hmm. you don't know how to cut or sew properly. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Okay. If you want to do anything you do in yes. life, mm -hmm. you must do it seriously. Mm -hmm. Anything has worth doing is worth doing, doing well. well yeah. So they make ridiculous film with bad, you know, non existent storyline. Mm -hmm. The actors are not actors. Okay, the, the actors people. are not actors, you said. Yes, because acting is about not acting. Okay. Do you know what you I understand? mean? understand? Yeah. Because, you see, a camera brings you right next to the audience. It's mm -hmm. as if they're sitting next right, to you. Right, exactly. A, a film director uh, is a director of actors as mm -hmm. well. And his task is to help the actor mm -hmm. give birth to mm -hmm. what he the actor has inside yeah, him, exactly, like, yeah. like a midwife. Yeah. Right. Y you know, you have to uh, uh, allow the actor to be natural, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. to 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 recreate. Mm -hmm. You know, you know the, the the audience must be able to read the meaning mm -hmm. from the expression of the actor. Mm -hmm. you, the actor would say, "I'm sad," or you know, something they pain me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> But they do it in they all just, this time. show it by their action. They, yeah. And they talk. Mm -hmm. They talk too much. Mm -hmm. And they have the problem they they have phonetic accent that oh, doesn't yeah. make sense. Yeah, not really. And their their makeup is horrible. The, the woman will get eyelash rich here from here to there. They are not natural. They're not natural. <laughs> hey, uh, Hollywood don't get back for here today. No, no, what I'm saying. No, <laughs> not I don't care. I watch films a lot. Mm. But when it is all this thing on DSTV, I can't watch two minutes of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You see, it's as if you're a tailor and you see somebody pass away, they sew in cloth, bad, mm, bad. You will notice it, yeah. If you, you should make her, mm. you see somebody where they... Yeah. Uh, Let me say this, right? Yeah. I, I don't watch Nollywood, to be honest. Yeah. I, I have nothing against Nollywood. But what I have to say, since, since my return to Nigeria, a lot of you may know by now that uh, I've spoken about my Jack Mada and, uh, you know, some other things. You would tell, like, my weight gain. My mother said the weight gain is from... Uh, she said the Nollywood language is like a peace of mind. Is where my weight gain is coming so don't write comments about my weight gain i know about it i'm working on it so don't go there okay <laughs> <laughs> you, you too chop you chop belefo that's why the weight too gain sweet. <laughs> now, what do you i do but anyway so Wait, i don't normally watch you they, you they chop japo everything nearly every i eat everything because, because you see when okay. i was in primary school about mm. we used to eat something called pataka in mm -hmm. the market with uh, but I can't call it. Uh, Jaku, uh, Jaku is uh, sorry for is one they call the African salad. But I believe in calling. No, 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 no. That is uh, Mpataka is African salad. They call it at, 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 in part of uh, Igbo land. They call it abacha. Yeah, yeah. They call uh, that abacha. So in fact, we had a song. Which one is Jaku? Jaku is yam because there's a difference Ooh. between cocoa yam okay. and cassava. Yeah. And and uh, yam. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Uh, yeah. 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 So we used to sing Onye Pataka Obaya Abia Rambegi Burubia Onye Pataka Obaya So we used to chop that That in Pataka is sweet Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. We used to have pocket money of like two pence Yeah, yeah. Two pence yeah. Yeah. But anyway, just so I don't forget what I was saying about Nollywood movies You know, I wouldn't typically watch Nollywood movies But since I returned uh, to Nigeria I have noticed like my family members are always watching it and so it's always in the background and i will say one of the things i have come to notice is almost all the nollywood movies i have to put this close to myself yeah, almost movies. all the their their video what they call them their, their okay. home video uh, uh, um, okay whatever nollywood is producing that i have seen yeah. typically i've come to notice the storyline is always about falling in love and getting married oh the man got the house girl the house girl became a wife oh he was driving a car he knocked this lady down the dad daddy he knocked down became a wife or sugar daddy yeah it's always about it's life all about you know anyways so he we've had this conversation before and he was like they need to be different storylines so we're talking about nollywood and uh, so what would be no, your... wait, i don't even like the word nollywood it, okay. it connotes that we're imitating something of uh, yeah know what you mean yeah now my complaint really yeah is that people jump into this without any training mm -hmm. you know if you want to be a, a, a train driver you have to learn how to yeah. to drive trains if you want to be an airline pilot you have to learn how to do it mm -hmm. even if you want to be a cook you have to learn how mm -hmm. to cook
But some people just jump into it. Mm -hmm. So that they have these automatic cameras now. They don't realize that the camera is a robot. So if you put somebody in front of a window where there's light, like it assumes that the, what is measuring as light is the window. Mm -hmm. So the person's face will be black. Mm -hmm. You know, you need cameras with, you know. Then there are specialized parts of filmmaking. Mm -hmm. There has to be a, 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 a storyteller, that mm -hmm. is the script writer, mm -hmm. because it's a story you are mm -hmm. telling. Mm -hmm. You are telling through the visual means, as mm -hmm. I'm saying, you know. Yeah. And, and then, uh, so there's often a collaboration between the uh, script writer and the film director, mm -hmm. okay? Now, is there's a collaboration between the actors and and the film director, the collaboration between the music, the person who writes the music, mm -hmm. and the collaboration with editing. Mm -hmm. The key to film is script line and editing. Mm -hmm. Editing is a key. And you also, like you told me before, they need to work on their storylines, right? Yes. Yeah. Because we know how to tell stories in Africa. Uh, we know we, we tell stories. Yeah, but, then, but, but they're not yeah. telling stories here. Mm -hmm. They just disappear and they shoot gun. They, go, <laughs> they catch the bullet like this. You know, and some of them are talented people, mm -hmm. but they're too much in a hurry mm -hmm. you know? to make quick money. You know? Yes, and and of course you don't go to the arts to make money. Mm -hmm. If you're an artist, yeah, like going into a monastery, you're going to like going to religion. Mm -hmm. You know, I was told the other day that somebody making film in Nigeria that the last film grossed one million dollars. I said, what? What? what so, yeah. so what? Mm -hmm. Who care? Mm -hmm. yeah? Okay. Is, uh, okay, now there are some naughty boys who say they are making the music. Mm. The music no get head or tail. <laughs> there's no melody, there's nothing. Then they say they are adding, I don't know how many million per show. Or mm. a, that's rubbish. Mm. Because it's not up to the artist to determine how mm. much you, you know. You are not into the arts for, mm. for money. In fact, uh, last year, uh, last year, yes, the present rubbish government uh, appointed a young lady to be Minister of Culture. Mm -hmm. This young lady is a youth copper. Oh. Now, this young lady uh, declared, uh, both in writing and sort of video, that she's going to turn culture into uh, an instrument of income for the country, that uh, culture will earn more than uh, oil for Nigeria. Hmm. So I said, is this person well? <laughs> is this person has escaped from, uh, from <laughs> a, a, a lunatic asylum? Because if culture were to be a source of income, why the British, they create BBC, they create uh, uh, British Council to export their culture mm. and they're pumping money into it. Mm. They're not making money from it. Wow. Why the French, they create a French Cultural Center? Why the German, they create Goethe mm. Institute? Mm. Are they using it as, as a part of the government revenue? Mm -hmm. You know? So this person has no knowledge of, uh, of, uh, of culture. Mm -hmm. There has no connection. Nobody in the cultural field know her. They just pick up from somewhere. You know why, how the go ministers are appointed in Nigeria? Oh. They go to the governor of a particular state. Mm. They say, bring somebody. Mm. That person, he can bring his house girl, he can bring his girlfriend, mm. he can bring a lunatic, mm. which, which is this particular case. This person okay. doesn't know anything mm. at all mm -hmm. about culture. Mm -hmm. Yet, they say he be minister. Mm. Are they making fun of us? Are they making fun of us? Are they making fun of us? But I don't want us to All right, let's not, let's not, yeah. on the topic of, you know, choosing to go back home. All right. Okay. The topic of choosing as someone that's lived abroad, married many, many years. a French lady, and uh, now divorced after fifty years of, okay. of marriage, <laughs> and uh, has uh, the children together and all of that. And grandchildren. And grandchildren <laughs> to finally decide. The interesting part is this. He chose to live the rest of his life in Nigeria. He wants to die and be buried in Nigeria. And his French wife chose to stay and live the rest of her life. Which is her right. Well, he, obviously, yeah, yeah. in France. But it's interesting because he's still bringing us back to the topic of wanting to go back to where you come from.